businesses continue to pull themselves out of the pandemic and other challenges, the La Mesa Chamber of Commerce is trying to find ways to get them in the spotlight. ABC 10 News reporter Ryan Hill explains how and why this is so important to these business owners. That's one of the many sounds of business. There are fewer and fewer small businesses in La Mesa. But running a small business isn't easy. We need all the help that we can get. It costs a lot of money to run a small business like this. I know it's been a challenge for everybody, not just for us. I guess we're all here for a purpose and you just gotta do the best you can and hold on. La Mesa's business community has been holding on and facing quite a few challenges in the last two years. Not only did my business community have to suffer through COVID, the riots, we, we had the National Guard here. Those riots in the summer of 2020 were in response to George Floyd's murder and local allegations of police misconduct. Some businesses were vandalized and burglarized. Now, more is being done to help businesses throughout the city. The La Mesa Chamber of Commerce is looking to help more of the business community burst onto the scene with Shop and Dine La Mesa. It recently secured American Rescue Plan funding from the county to hold this pilot event to highlight businesses which feel they're often overlooked by potential shoppers. We always hear shop local, but we also want people to shop throughout the region because there are a lot like this, this shopping center, for instance, some of the people don't really know what they offer and that was part of this project. Whether it's rising from the ashes or still plugging away each day, <laughs> some owners are glad to get the buzz and sizzle toward their business. Thank you. That's exactly what goes through my head because it's the foundation of what, where we all come from. Without the support of the Chamber of Commerce, we don't have a foundation for us to all fall back on and rely on. Ryan Hill, ABC 10 News.